Welcome to Total Request Live, Bro House Edition with Justin Potter and Fetty Soria. So we're doing Target board hacks. I bought this at Target. It looks really similar to a Walmart board, but it's not a Walmart board. I mean, Walmart sells Kryptonics. This is Maple Skateboards, but it looks like it came out of the exact same factory. It even has the skate stopper. So I don't know, I wanna see if it's different. It's, it's also the same plastic wrap underneath the trucks and bolts, which just sucks. But I wanted to basically take this board and piece by piece upgrade it. And the purpose of this video is to show you guys why you shouldn't buy a cheap board like this. I think this was 20 bucks. And we're gonna show you why you shouldn't buy it and exactly how each part affects the performance. All right, so the first thing that we're gonna do is take off the skate stopper. And I guess they put this on there so you don't skate it in the store. Now, one thing that you can do, if you did buy this cheap board, it will help if you take a tool like this. It's called a skate tool. And loosen up, see how like tight it is? I noticed that the bearings aren't necessarily that bad. They just tighten it too tight. First hack right there, right off the bat. I don't have a hack for this part. This part sucks, no matter how you do it. It's just the worst. We won't really be able to handle this until we replace the trucks, which is gonna take a while. We got a lot of stuff to replace. It's such a weird plastic too. Trucks. It is weird plastic. It's like choppy. Yeah, what if we break it before it, we put it in the hack? Before it's fully hacked. Well, then we're gonna have to just hack the deck. You know what this grip feels like? It feels what? like the, um, the spray on grip. One thing I do notice about this that's different than a Walmart board, I think this is real wood. That is different than a Kryptonics. Like, Kryptonics is not wood. Let's do it, why not? Okay. It's kind of nice, actually, the way it rolls. I'm not skating until it's hacked. What do you think? It's actually really nice. It's actually not bad, dude. It's way better than a Walmart. It actually pops. It's made of wood. Yeah. Don't break it till we hack it. Are you okay, Fedgy? Now what? Try it down the three. All right, some grinds and slides. First hack, wax it. Nice, light, mild hack. What do you think of it so far, Justin? How's it skate compared to Walmart board? It skates a lot better. It's so sticky. Yeah, that slides a lot better. You wanna try the hubba? No slide in 50-50? Yeah. <laughs> really? Really, Greg? Oh. It's this. Is that what's messing you up? Yeah. Oh. First tee. Okay, it's kind of weird. Why, why are you having trouble? I can't see out of my left eye. That's the main reason. So it has nothing to do with the board then? No. Justin, have you ever skated a Walmart board? Yes, I know you have. Yes, I have. We played a game of skate on it. Yeah. I wanted to get your opinion of this. What should I start with? Whatever you want to start with. Try it out. You know, you, a it's a board review. Tricks. More poppy than a regular Walmart. It's like, it's still slow. There's no wheel bite. Okay, is this proving to be harder? Yeah. I mean, the wheels are sliding a it's lot. It's super like slippery. <laughs> Cats. What are you running into? I'm not landing. Kind of slippery, but it's like at the same time not. I'll try it. Try it out. You've skated Walmart board pretty good, right? Oh, yeah. Like a lot, I mean. Yeah, I mean, isn't this, this isn't Walmart though. It's Target. So we're trying to compare the difference. Woo! 
These are actually pretty loose. I usually think that Walmart are tight. Board's normal. I think the Walmart wheels are better. All right, we'll attack it. I was thinking what we should do is change out the wheels and keep the bearings. I was thinking the opposite. Change out the bearings and keep the wheels. Yeah, because the bearings don't roll at all. These ones are better than the Walmart though. Like, normally the Walmarts just fall right out. Are we changing wheels and bearings? I'm just gonna see what kind of what it looks like. This one looks worse. What do you think? Do you want to try that? I was thinking of putting the bearings in here. Okay, you'd rather do that? Yeah. All right. I think the bearings are the worst part of the board. Super awesome on delay ABEC 7s, which is this nicer than ABEC 5? Yes. So these are like one step up from their ABEC 5s. And uh, big thanks to Joey Brzezinski for sending us these bearings. Nice, these are super sick. These are on delay bearings. Look at that though, you can just see how much nicer that is already. These are super good bearings. I think it's cool though with the black on black. Would have been cool with the ABEC 5s too, they're yellow. I wanted to use the Swisses, those are like the really nice ones, but not that level of hacking. Three hours later. See that, that's, that's what I mean. That just came right out. See that, that's not, it's not supposed to pop out that easy. So do you think this will make it easier to skate? Maybe, we'll find out. I mean, you skated it pretty good already. Try it out, Freddy. Oh, much better. Next is definitely the trucks. Yeah, the trucks. So trucks the wheels. No, the wheels are fine. Really? They're just plastic. It's getting worse and worse. My foot's just starting to slide right off. Okay, there's another problem with these boards that doesn't normally happen with regular grip tape. Keep that in mind if you're gonna buy this. Oh, it rolls so nice though. Yeah. The wheels are so good even though there's a flat spot. Maybe even put grip tape on it. Yeah, I don't know if we can do that, but we'll try. Clean. The trucks are getting looser and looser. Not Fetty's forte. It's like Pokemon Go. Just gotta catch it. Oh my god. I think that was the wheel's fault. I feel like these wheels are too slippery. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> like melted? Let's show that to the audience. That's the problem with these wheels on these cheap boards is that they flat spot so damn easy. Oh, it's super warm. Yeah, melted. Yeah, that's the wheels. Pack it. Said he died. I think the wheels are the problem. He was saying it's the trucks, but every time he was like landing it, he would completely slide out. And Justin, you had that problem too, right? Yep. I'm gonna replace the wheels. Before we replace the trucks, you just see if that makes a big difference. I think you can land it first try now that I'm doing this. I think so. If you land it first try, I will get you a Cherokee red cherry soda. How about a Cherokee purple grape soda? I don't know if they make it. All right, so I, I think this is a kind of a cool color scheme. If you notice, I think the board is slightly heavier. Try it out, Freddy. That's a lot better. Yeah? How is it better? I don't know. I'm not melting into the ground. Try a big spin. I'm not used to the, the trucks being yeah. so loose. Well, now I'm not sliding out, I'm dripping to the ground. Yeah, it rolls so nice. <laughs> Try it, full capsule. First tee, Cherokee Red. <laughs> that was just some wood. The full cap was really nice. So it's still hard to skate. It's because of grip. There's no grip. We just can't hack this damn thing. Almost. It's right there. My foot just keeps slipping. 
Same thing, is that no grip? It didn't pivot at all. I mean, I think it was fine for the, the level of hack we're at. Yes, yeah, so there was some toe drag, but you understand we're not fully hacked yet. Are we putting grip tape on it? Yeah, we can do that. I want to keep hacking it. So we can see that this trick is extremely difficult at this level of hack. I'm like Fetty Potter's caddy right now, golf caddy. I'm gonna go ahead and put some grip on his board. You're gonna like grip over the grip? I uh, guess is the only way to do it. This is a hack that we did not do last time. We have this Random mini logo grip thing. The kind of the point of this video is to show skaters around the world, new and old alike, specifically new skaters, the importance of the proper equipment and what each part does and how it affects and basically why you shouldn't spend 20 bucks on a board if you're really serious about skating. I give it about three tries before the grip sheet comes completely off. Too major, grippy. Major flick. Super grippy. Alright, shall we try it again? Let's try it again and see what happens. We'll see if we can finally hack this damn thing. I didn't land right. But what do you think so far? A lot better. Okay. It's like an eight, right? Like a seven, seven. Rough day for Fetty. Oh, that was it. And that was probably the trucks. What happened there? That was all the trucks. It was a wheel bike. Oh. The reason why I want to do this is because I want to see if they do tighten. Sometimes Walmart trucks, no matter how much you tighten them, they don't tighten. Yeah, it seemed to be. Betty like super tight trucks. So we feel like it's, it's much better now? Yeah, it's much better. How does it feel compared to when you last skated it? The same. The same? Have you hacked it yet? Ah, for real. No, seriously, I don't feel anything different. What is it, the hardware? The hardware different? This kid. First try laser flip. <laughs> it rides really well. Okay. It's like actually really smooth. I think these new wheels help a lot. It kind of feels like a new complete. Besides, I, th I feel like the board shape is like really skinny. Small. It's yeah, like that's a seven what Freddie was saying. Otherwise, I don't even feel the trucks. Like the trucks have to feel pretty good. Out of all, because that's not hack yet. No. Have you ever landed a laser before? Dude, I gotta land that now. Now you kind of gotta land it. Take it down. Take it down. Okay, it's about to do an MBD here. First ever laser flip on a hacked target board. I feel so honored. It's starting to lose pop, I feel. It doesn't have much left in it. Gotta land it right now. Take it down. All right, Kelly, right here, and you'll give me a jamba? Right here for a jamba for two. Okay. Right here, first track. That's it, dude. You got this. 
Kelly Wakasa can laser flip. Kelly Laser Wakasa, that's your new nickname. Dude, he's got it, like literally every try. Yes. Yeah! All right, Jamba Juice. Could you have done that on, without it being hacked? I think without it being hacked, I could never have done that. So it didn't I make think a this is my favorite board. I think the wheels help so much because if I think if we had the other wheels, it would just slip right out. Every yes, time. that's true. And this, these wheels are like a lot crippier. Helps what about so the grip tape? And the grip tape as well, obviously. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I give it an A plus for your hero hack. So what do you think about the hack? Uh, yeah, I think it helps a lot. <laughs> Should I do another task and flip, see if it's easier? Yeah. Far easier. Are you sure it's easier? I think so. The trucks are pretty tight. That's Fetty. That's why I'm like kick turning so much. This is your last hack, the last and final hack. The trucks. The trucks. Aaron just showed up. He was filming for his part. This is Kmart board hacks. No, target board. Oh yeah? What are you hacking? So far we've hacked the grip tape, the wheels, oh, yeah. and the bearings. So what now? The trucks. Now you're gonna the final element. Change the trucks and change the board? Oh, it's hacked! <laughs> this was a surprising amount of work to get the truck off. You know what's funny? I didn't even take the time to get the damn plastic off. Forgot, I was so frustrated. We had already gripped it, so the bolts were hard to find, and then when we used the skate tool on these bolts, they wouldn't come off easily. So, I don't know, just these weird little things that you notice when you deal with these cheaper boards. These are honestly so bad. I feel like I could just break it. Oh, okay, it's not that. Come on. It's pretty flimsy. Like, it just looks... Don't let your dreams be dreams. Okay, so now we have a completely hacked target board. Now, the point of this is not to show you guys that this is what you should do to make your target board better, because that would be stupid. You'd be spending a lot of money for basically a really cheap deck. The point of this is just to show you how each piece of equipment affects the board, and why, if you're serious about skating, you should just go all in when you buy your first board and get force wheels, on delay bearings, a revived deck. Okay, so what do you think, Kelly? I haven't just skated it yet. Do you think it's hacked? Oh, yeah, it's hacked. Oh, and they're a little bit tighter. I like that. The trucks are now a lot better. They're, they're, they're even more smooth. I mean, the real test is grinding. Should we grind? We should grind. So fast. Couldn't even get my feet around that. Obviously they grind good. Grinds They're just amazing. normal trucks. Did you see what we did? Trucks. New trucks. That almost be better with old. <laughs> it was better before we hacked it. We unhacked it? Yeah, unhacked it. Fetty Potter X Chris Chan collab. Fetty Chan. I right, hit the hubba. Oh. All right, without a doubt, it's better. First tee, right here. Yeah, first shot. I don't know what happened. Five stair. Back in? Yeah. Really the only thing that would make it better is if there was probably, if there was concave. And maybe a little bit wider. Definitely hacked. So, that's the end of this episode of Hacks. It was really fun to hack, and we hacked it, and it was definitely hacked. Without a doubt, we hacked it. 
like I said, the purpose of this is just to show you guys a little bit more about equipment and how it affects your skateboard. So I hope you enjoyed it. Watch the other episode of Hacks right here in this playlist. Subscribe, like, leave a comment below, and follow Justin on Instagram at